Hello friends, welcome to this another video from Telcolan. In this video, we are going to talk about 5G core service based architecture. 5G core service based architecture includes a lot of different components from 5G core network, which includes components like AMF, SMF, UDM, PCF, AUSF, NRF, NEF, NSSF, along with some kind of application function. This also includes some user plane functions like UPF, which connects us to DN or data network. The core network connects towards the radio network, which consists your G node B, and the G node B will in turn connect to your U, U, user equipment. All these network functions, which are shown in this picture, are not physical hardwares. They are typically either some kind of virtualized network function or some kind of cloud native network function. And they're all created in cloudified environment by using some COTS kind of architect hardwares. COTS, which is commercial off the shelf hardware, can be generic hardware or maybe some kind of server which can use virtualization or containerization techniques and can host all these network function. In the upcoming videos, we are going to talk about all these network functions one by one. All these network functions will have some interfaces which are referred as SBI or service based interfaces where they provide services to other network functions with the help of RESTful API architecture. All these network functions, they communicate to each other by using HTTP2 kind of protocol where all the 3GB specific data is written in the JSON formats. So we are moving away from the traditional protocol architectures in telecom and getting into some web based architecture, which is like HTTP2. So in the upcoming videos, we are going to talk about all these network functions one by one. In this slide, we are going to talk about the abbreviation of all these network functions. The AMF, which is similar to the MME of 4G network, is called as access and mobility management function. AUSF is authentication server function, which helps the network to do the authentication in the home network part of it. The PCF is similar to PCRF, which, which does the policy control part. NSSF takes care of the network slice selection. NEF is for the network exposure. NRF is the network repository function, which is like a yellow pages for all the producer NFs which are available. The SMF or session management function takes care of creation, maintenance and terminations of session. CHF is the charging function. UPF is the user plane function, which typically gets the data, user data from the G node B and sends it to PDN or DN in the, in, in the case of 5G and other way around as well. UDM is the management part for the unified data, which typically uses, uses the UDR or unified data repository. We can also have some unstructured data storage function named as UDSF. NWDF network data analytics function, NWDF network data analytics function is the new network function which collects the network data from all the network functions, does some analytics and provides some kind of inputs to PCF and NSSF. And application functions are the applications which are deployed by the operator themselves. All these network functions have some kind of SBI or service based interfaces, which are typically the letter N. Along with that, we are writing the name, name of the network function in the small letters. So just like that, AMF system service based interface becomes NAMF, UDM service based interfaces becomes NUDM. That's all we have in this video. In the upcoming videos, we are going to talk about all these network functions 